following section will introduce you to several effect configurations and its operations. PIP Special Effects When PIP button is enabled, the subsource image is displayed in a small window, which is superimposed over the main source. The window is available in two sizes. Toggle between the small and the large buttons to set the window size. Move the window to your desired position by pressing the upper left, lower right, or lower left and upper right key. With POS control key lit, manually control the position of PIP with the joystick. You can also add a border by pressing the BDR button repeatedly to choose a thin border, medium border, or thick border, or none at all. Having chosen the suitable border, press the border color key repeatedly to add and change its color. There are eight colors to choose from, black, blue, red, pink, green, yellow, and white. When you are done, press the take key to send the output to the main picture-in-picture -picture output screen. Press the PIP key to deactivate and exit PIP mode. Mosaic key for mosaic effects. Press the mosaic key to apply the mosaic effect. Choose from six different block sizes and window sizes. Press the large key or the small key to select the size of mosaic coverage. Similar to the picture-in-picture's position control operation, you can press the POS control key and use the joystick to move the mosaic's position. Upon completion, you can press the mosaic key again to deactivate the mosaic special effects. Paint Paint Special Effects When the Paint key is enabled, the Paint effect is applied. There are six different levels of effects, varying in the speed and extent of the region affected. After setting up, press the Take key to output the effect. Press the Paint key again to exit Paint Special Effects. CK key and CK sync key are for chroma key effects. Details of the use of this together with the menu settings are described later. CG key, subtitle effect. When SE900 is connected to a character generator and the CG key is enabled, subtitles are displayed. The CG interconnectivity, configuration, and parameters will be described in detail later. STRB, key for strobe effects. When STRB key is lit, the picture frame appears with six different levels of speed and levels. After setting up, press the Take button to send the frame to the main output screen. Press the STRB key again to exit the strobe effect. BW, key for black and white monochrome special effects. Press the BW button to stand by in black and white preview output mode. Press the Take key to send a black and white output to the main output screen. Press the BW key to exit the black and white mode and revert to color mode. Logo, Logo key. The use of logo and related key perimeters will be introduced later in detail. BDR, Border key. With the BDR keylet, a border will be added to PIP and transition effects. This was covered earlier. 
In this example, we demonstrate how to manually add a border to a transition special effect. First, select the desired transition effect. Then press the BDR key to select a desired width, example, M, medium width, in the status display. Press the border color button to select a desired color, example, yellow, which will be displayed in the status display. Preview the effect by using the T-bar. Try making variations such as changing the border color to black or pressing the BDR key to select W, wide border. Check to see if this is the desired effect using the T-bar to view the transition. To remove the border effect, press the BDR key repeatedly until there is no border.